For any high school senior, graduation is a coming of age. In the small town of Cabot, with a class size of only 17, one more senior finally got the chance to graduate just a few years later than expected. I uh, sure won't, won't, won't know when he graduates. 90-year-old <laughs> World War II veteran Winton Bucky Walbridge stepping into a surprise ceremony of his own 74 years later. As we were looking through pictures, we saw I saw a picture of him in his uniform. So of course, I'm a history teacher, so I start asking questions. His granddaughter Amanda had to know her family's history. He then told me that his brother was actually drafted to go to war, but his brother had a wife and they had kids. My dad talked to his parents, his brother, and you know, he said that he would take his place. Bucky shipped off to Japan, building military bases for a year. He missed graduation by just three short months and never went back. You know, high school, there was no given that you'd graduate. But Amanda contacted the school that he went to all those years ago. Cabot School is proud to recognize him tonight for his life achievement. Bucky received an honorary diploma, two Vermont Veterans Medals, and three standing ovations. All of it a surprise for the soon-to-be 91-year-old. And his ninth grade transcript got the stamp of approval from the family teacher. I told him he wasn't that great in civics, but being a, a man of the farm, he did excellent in agriculture. And on my next birthday, July, July 6th, getting old. Now, Bucky's family says this really meant a lot to them, and it gives them some closure in this entire thing. And he now shares an anniversary with his son, Brian, who you saw there, who says he graduated high school 40 years ago to the day. So this story really coming together full circle. From the Live Desk, Tom Garris, NBC5 News.